But you're obviously quite a spiritual person as well, based on my stalking and our conversation. So I want to know your take on how food affects us in more than just nutrients. What, what do you think on that whole concept? Mm, well, I think that when we eat meat, we're definitely consuming the energy stored in the animal's body. And if we really think to how animals are treated um, before they die, we can probably assume that it's not great, that they're probably terrified, that they're probably scared and anxious and it's quite interesting to me when we look around and you know mental health is such a big topic that's being discussed at least over the last decade now more than ever where people are actually considering mental health but it's like we're not we're not quite there yet when we're looking at the dna of what we're consuming and how it's affecting our dna um, and we're not considering it on an energetic level yet, but I think that when we do, we'll find that most of our emotions and most of our fatigue and most of our unease, our dis-ease in our minds, it's not even ours. It's from what we're consuming and it's from what is being perpetuated because everyone's consuming it in the masses. Everyone's consuming this meat, this anxiety, this fear, this death frequency. It's in their bodies and they're just acting it out in the physical world and their day-to-day -day behavior and their speech. And, you know, we, we pick it up and we absorb it. So it's just like this perpetuating loop. And that's what we experience. That's, that's what we have grown to accept. And so we don't see that there's like a problem with it yet. But I think we're going to, I think it's gonna happen really soon where we're more conscious of the energies of the foods that we're eating. Because if you look at plants, plants have already like achieved their highest consciousness. When it's spring, they grow. When it's summer, they thrive. When it's fall, they know when to start to wilt. When it's winter, they allow themselves to die off. Their willingness to just go through the motions is impeccable. Our willingness to change and grow. <laughs> <laughs> Another question. Yeah. Not, not, not great. <laughs> and people always say, dude, okay, can I just rant for a second? Go people, for it. Oh, 